in a way that you interact with, with uh, the audiences and, and the groups and the children and, and the people that you work with and then the, the community. So uh, is, the, is there a, a difference between the public and the personal or is, does it meld? It's really special when it does mold together into one. Um, yeah, I would, I'd like to say that there's this all encompassing like oneness of music all the time. But there's times when people pay me to play, right? And I'm there because they're they're there to feel something, and it doesn't matter how much I slept before, how much I'm feeling this. I need to be able to channel that energy of like that piece of music when I wrote it, so that I can perform and 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 be that. And so there is. Well, I would I think. Ideally, and there are moments where it is this oneness, there's a sense of duty also of saying that there's this one moment, especially if it's just a live performance that we have together, and this is what I signed up for, and I want to make sure that the people listening really enjoy it. It is like it is a, a service there, and I think there's nothing wrong with, um, with seeing it that way because there's so many things that could be affected by people in the audience that you may not even feel or be aware of, but just you giving your best and seeing it as a service for them can still have that impact, even if you don't feel it at that moment, as, as they do, so. Dennis, I, is it always the same? Is it always personal for you? Yes, it is always personal. The reason why I, I laughed is because sometimes I don't always want to sing the song that they want me to sing, <laughs> um, or like <laughs> Sunday when they call you at the last minute to sing for three church services, and you have to sing high early in the morning. <laughs> but you know what? Uh, it always, if I'm honest, it is always personal for me. Um, I don't, I don't, maybe it's because of the content of what I'm singing about, um, but I know my mom always tells me, first of all, do everything like you're doing it for God. And she always says, um, if you want other people to feel it, you have to first feel it yourself. And so, therefore, anything that I go into, like even when I'm producing a beat, shout out to Solo Steve's here, um, there just first has to be a feeling with inside because if I'm creating music, if I'm, if the truth be told, most of the music that I create is is for me first. Um, so in that sense, it's therapeutic, um, it's celebratory, it's all of those things. And what happens in the effect or the impact that it has on the audience for me becomes secondary. So yeah, it, it is always personal. And uh, Mary, one of the things that Kai said